Hello viewers, you are welcome to Next Consult. It's been a long time that I did a video for you, but today I would like to show you how you can place your video on one side, then a scripture to on the other side. But before that, I would like to show you some few things that I did. Um, I did with Photoshop. I actually designed this thing with Photoshop. So if you know how to use Photoshop, you can equally design your own. Okay, good. Then let's take this one to be my video. All right. Yes, I just want to make it quick so that you get everything. Okay so now that we have our image our image here actually the bigger one will be for the scripture then the smaller one will be for the video then i've made sure that i've opened uh easy worship to uh, the background section let me open that one for you to see where is it where is it easy worship so here is it and with easy worship if you want to link it to the other device you're supposed to do some few settings over here okay uh one last thing that i would like to show you when you go to in order to link the easy worship to the vmix you should go to edit and go to more op and go to options and that the output monitor make sure you select ndi stream this will give the software audacity to push whatever thing that you type you shoot whatever scripture that you shoot over here to the vmx so that was what i did to the vmx so like i said this one will be for the video then the other part will be for the scripture let's go back again and see whether it's working okay so so long as you have your you have your image in the vmx you hover around to the settings button okay but let me let me add a scripture first so that you go to add input just for the truth just a simple process you go to add input then you select ndi tools so we are picking the scripture for an easy worship so that is the ndi capture for easy worship so you select it then you click on ok all right so let's scroll down to see okay we have a scripture here i would like to move it upwards so that it will not let's see Uh, okay okay so we have now we have a video we have a scripture over here you are going to place everything on this image that we see over here okay so let's hover around the settings for this So that's the settings. Then we will go to multi view. Okay, multi view. Okay, uh, you like everything to be like this. Okay, so and the multi view section. 
you will select our video for it to appear here but first we have to edit it so that it will fit into that box so you go to edit all right then you okay so we'll play around this so you can just play around with it so that you know which one that works for you all right okay so we are done with this let's move on to layers and multi view again then let's select the second image that will be for the scripture all right so let's hover around edit mm. let's see something over here the scripture the scripture i just want to watch something over here some more time the machine is moving very slow so that i can do everything for you all right good now it's working so i'll move okay then I will extend it a bit for you. All right. Okay. You can actually use the mouse to also move it. Okay. All right. When you're done, then you close it. So now we have everything on one. So let's push it over here you see let me reduce the volume so now you can see that should this one has having to be happen to be the video it will have been moving by now okay then this one having to be the scripture that is the one that i have over here and the easy worship so that is all that i have to show you about adding a video and a scripture on the same page like i showed you over here it's just a simple approach if you are having any difficulty feel free to contact me and i'll be glad to assist you bye bye